Hey guys and gals, it's Adventure Link here, back again today with another episode of Maintaining the Dodge Jenny. Yeah! As always, this is the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 Variable Valve Timing 2013 Dodge Journey Crew Edition. And what we're going to do today is remove the MAF sensor. That's um, Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor. I said MAF, I meant to say MAP. My bad. First thing you got to do is remove this engine cover. We all know how that goes by now. Rip. Just like that. Next thing you want to do is uh, remove this electrical connector from your vehicle. There's a red lock. I just took my fingernail and got on the side. Out it comes. From there, you just squeeze it in. And you squeeze it in. You'll sh get it out there. Just like that. Now, I was told by a user on one of my Dodge Jenny groups, I forget which one it was exactly, his name is Roxas, that how to remove the map, the map sensor here. You have to put it in the 3 o'clock position. That may have been true on his Dodge Jenny, but on a Pentastar V6 2013, you put it at the 4 o'clock position, and out it comes. Yay! And from here you can just clean this out. I've been told just to use... Mass airflow sensor cleaner on this. Don't use brake clean, carb cleaner, blah, 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 blah. Because you might wreck something inside there. And if you ever do need a replacement, manifold absolute pressure or MAP sensor. The part number is 051491741AB. So benefits of cleaning out this math, or manifold absolute pressure sensor, rather, is this Roxas guy claimed to get more gas mileage out of it. So if you're having gas mileage problems or if you want to just do some preventative maintenance, this would be a good thing to do. Otherwise, if yours is broken for some reason, well, now you know how to replace it. Again, use some mass airflow sensor cleaner here. I got some from CRC. You can use your brand of choice. So this has been my quick video. Thanks to Roxas on one of my Dodge Jenny forums on how to remove the MAP or Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor from your Pentastar V6 powered Dodge Jenny. Please note this may differ from the 4 cylinder versions and the 3.5 liter Dodge Jennies that was in the earlier models 29, 2009, 10, and 11. And I'm Adventure Lake. Thank you for watching my video. Yeah! Thanks for watching to the end. Thanks for your support past, present, and future. Be sure to do all the things on that help make me help make me make a living on YouTube and get my word out. You know, rate, comment, subscribe. The captain's bell if I did a good job. If you never want to miss another video again, remember to ring that bell. Dodge Journey groups. I've got three of them on Facebook. Go there if you have any questions or concerns on a Dodge Journey. Otherwise, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, praise, criticisms on this video, please drop them in the YouTube comments below this video. And speaking of the description, social media links and medical bill donation links are in the video description. Please consider donating. Any amount helps out. And as Games from the Grave would say, it'll keep this channel and myself alive and undead. And we'll wise up, sign off with a wise word of wisdom from Eric the Card. I remind you guys to be safe, have fun, and of course, stay dirty. But do keep your mass airflow sensors and manifold absolute pressure sensors clean, though. It's for the best. See you all next time. Have a nice day or evening or whatever time of the day this is for you.